first day of school. Do you think my outfit's a little too much? Uh, Aubrey, what are you wearing? What in dog's name do you think you're wearing? Hey, quit it. I suggest you listen. Thank you. <gasps> oh no, it's him. Are you sure you're okay? You're not really acting like yourself. I guess I'm just embarrassed. You brought a lot of attention to us. I don't like that. I wonder what I can do to make it up to her. I'm better today. I'm sorry I kind of lashed out on you. It's okay. Oh, um, actually, I remember. I, uh, I made you something. You did? Yeah, um, here, let me put it on you. There! Oh, wow. It's beautiful. Thank you, Aubrey. No problem. I kind of made it match mine, so they're like friendship necklaces, you know? Yeah, thank you. I know you don't really wear pink and stuff, but I thought, you know, uh... I thought it would be okay this time, since, um, they kind of match, you know? Yeah. Oh, and if you want, we can hang out after school, too. Yeah, that would be nice. Uh, watch where you're going. Hey, you're the one that ran into her. <laughs> Whatever. Ow. Oh, um, I'm, I'm sorry. It's fine. You didn't mean to. It was my fault for standing in the middle of the hallway. Sophie, you didn't do anything wrong. It's fine. Hey, isn't that the boy from yesterday? Yeah, it is. So, what's your name? Oh, uh, I'm Sophie. Uh, you are? Uh, my name's Layla. It's nice to meet you. Sorry I bumped into you like that. Yeah, it's, it's fine. You didn't mean to. Uh, hi, Ethan. Hi. Oh my dog, how is your fur so soft looking? Oh, I just used shampoo. I ditched conditioner a long time ago. I've never heard of a dog's fur looking so soft with just shampoo. What brand do you use? Just the generic silk brand, you know. <laughs> uh... Oh, uh, the bell. Ah, perfect timing. Uh, let's, let's go, Sophie. Me and Layla actually have algebra together, so we're just gonna walk. Oh. Okay, uh, Ethan, do you want to walk to English? Sure. <gasps> no. What is it? Look, you're walking with me. I highly doubt Haley's gonna try anything. No, it's not her. Uh, I'll explain in class. Let's go. Alright class, so today we are going to be talking about our first project of the year. I have planned out a fun little project that I think you all can enjoy. Uh, we are going to be writing about ourselves. So, to meet the criteria for this project, all you have to do is write a single paragraph writing a letter to me all about you. Let me know what your interests are, what your likes are, what do you like about reading, um, how do you feel about group projects, that type of stuff. It's a really easy project and I think you all can do this uh, quite easily in class today. Um, if you don't get it done today, that is okay. I'm making this assignment due on Friday. It was the pink poodle who scared me. She used to be my best friend. Uh, once you finish writing the letter to me, you can make a little note at the bottom of the page letting me know if you want to read this in front of the class or if you want to, um... You mean Gracie? You just want it to be a private letter to What me. happened? Um, I yes, her. To me, but when we were friends, I, I found out something about myself, 
and I told her about it, but she didn't like it and left me. What'd you tell her? I'd rather not say it's my fault she left. It's probably not your fault. She's always been a bitch. Not always. So you're not going to tell me what you told her? This time around... I decided we would start with reading and then we can get into our free rights. I don't so want her to get into we trouble reading, because of me. Um, Even though she hurt you? Well, like I said before, it was my fault. Romeo and Juliet. It is a wonderful story. I'm sure many of you have heard of it already. Ethan, it's so good to see that you've already started on your assignment. Usually by now you'd be asleep. Is it okay if I look it over? Uh oh. Uh actually. Actually, no. Um, I don't. I don't like what I writ, wrote so far. <sighs> let me see the paper. Yeah, no. Ethan, if you don't let me look at this paper, I will be sending you to the dean's office. Uh. Uh, no need. Actually, I was just about to head there myself. Ethan, you can't just walk out of the classroom. Uh, actually, I can. Because I'm going to the dean's office. Like you wanted me to. Ugh, what am I going to do with this kid? Hi, yes, this is Mrs. Maple. I need to uh, report that a kid is going down to the dean's office. It is Ethan Miller, as per usual. out later? Uh, yeah. Ooh, you guys gonna hang out? Can I come? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Awesome. Hey, uh, where's Ethan? Oh, uh, yeah, about that. Um, uh, he kind of got in trouble, uh, because of me. What did you do? Uh, we were passing notes in class, and then, um, the teacher wanted to see, and then he kind of went to the dean's office. Aubrey, why would you do that? I didn't mean to. I didn't think he'd get in trouble. I was going to see if he would come hang out with us after school, but I guess now I can't. What do you want me to do? Oh, do you want to come hang out with us? Hey, did you get in trouble? Since I kind of turned myself in, no. And uh, what makes you think I'm going to hang out with a bunch of freshmen? You're only a sophomore. It's not that big of a difference. Yeah, I'm gonna have to bail out on this one. We're just going to the park outside of school. It'd be kind of fun if you could come. Uh, wasn't it just supposed to be me and you? Uh, fine, I guess I'll come. You want me to bring any, uh, extra stuff? Oh, yes, please. Alright, well, I'm gonna go now. I'll see you right after school, okay? Bye, Layla! <laughs> I guess I'll get going now, too, then. Uh, bye, Bree. Uh, see you later, Ethan. Uh, bye. Uh, you don't have to come if you don't want to. Oh, uh, it's fine. I really could care less. Not like I have anything better to do. Oh, okay. Um, you're sure you didn't get in trouble or anything? Uh, well, no more trouble than I usually get in. Uh, I mean, what do you expect out of a dog like me, am I right? I guess I'll see you later then, Bree. Uh, bye. Oh, uh, yeah, later. Why do they always walk away before I can say goodbye? I wonder where they are. They're probably on their way. I hope they don't mind that I brought some extra snacks. I'm sure they won't mind. <laughs> oh, there she is. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, Layla. Uh, Layla? Your eyes look a little, uh... <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Layla, are you... are you high? <laughs> Me? High? <laughs> oh, maybe a little. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm hungry. Oh, Aubrey brought food for us, so if you want some, you can have some. Is that a biscuit? Uh, Sophie, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, what's up? Uh, I didn't think that there would be any drugs involved here. 
Sophie, it's just some need. It doesn't matter. Mm, this is so good. Excuse me, do you want some? <laughs> no, thank you, Layla. You can keep it all to yourself. Mm. Oh, hey, it's Ethan. <gasps> Ethan, oh my God. Ethan. Uh, hey guys. Uh, I see you are already uh, having a good time there. Oh my God, yes. Thank you, Aubrey, for the delicious food. I am thoroughly enjoying it right now. It's so good. Oh my god, it's so good. It's so good. I love it. It's so good. It's so delicious. I just like, oh my god, the biscuits. <laughs> the biscuits. They remind me of my grandma. <laughs> Grandma's fine. I promise I didn't put anything in the biscuits. <laughs> okay then. Oh, Ethan, how could you? The ultimate betrayal. You didn't even bring any stuff. Just because I didn't bring it doesn't mean I don't have it. You think I can just carry this around with me? <gasps> oh my gosh, let me have some. Whoa, not so fast. We're gonna be sharing this. <sighs> well, I'm not sharing any biscuits, so. What is happening? What did you expect, Aubrey? We're high schoolers. <laughs> this is what we do. Not all high schoolers. I think I'm gonna go home. Yeah, that's probably for the best. Oh, uh, sorry. You sure you don't want anything? Uh, yeah, I'm more than sure I don't want any of your stuff. Uh, Layla, you can keep the biscuits. I'm gonna go home. Aubrey, no! Aubrey, no, you can't go. I'm sorry, this is just not the crowd I wanna hang out with. Aubrey, I was kidding, come back. I'm sorry, Sophie, I really am. I just, I don't wanna get into trouble and, and, and I don't want you to get into trouble either. You should come home with me. Aubrey, I'm not gonna do anything stupid and we're not gonna get into trouble, right, Ethan? You've done this like a million times. Uh, I make no guarantees. Exactly, Sophie. We should be going. Whatever, you can go. I'm gonna stay and I'm gonna have fun. Sophie, just go. Aubrey, why are you home late? I was just at the park with some friends. <laughs> Mom, Aubrey came home late. I think she was up to no good. Blair, not now. You're gonna get in trouble. Blair. Blair, what's wrong this time? Aubrey came home late. Blair, she told me she was gonna be home late. She was at the park with some friends. I trust her, unlike you. Uh, uh, Mom? Aubrey, sweetie, are you okay? No. Sweetie, what's wrong? I, I... I don't know what's happening. Everything is just moving so fast. Growing up does that to us sometimes. You'll be all right, honey. Is there anything going on at school that I need to know about? Uh, well, I saw Gracie at school and it brought back some memories and uh, Sophie's been acting different and she made a new friend, but I don't know if she's that good for her. And there's this guy who seemed all right, but I don't know. I'm sorry, honey. You won't have to worry about Gracie too much since you aren't in the same grade, but I'm sure it can get really nerve wracking seeing her in the hallways. Mom, that's where everything bad happens, in the hallways. That's when Haley came up to me and then I saw her. It just seems like it's gonna be inevitable to run into her at some point. Just do your best to avoid her, honey. That's all you can do. And with Sophie, I'm not really sure what's going on with her. She's always been a sweet girl. Maybe she's going through something of her own. <sighs> You're right. And this boy, do you have a crush on him? Oh, dog, no. He, he's, he's, uh, uh, 
kind of gross. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, let me know if anything develops. Mom. Ooh, Aubrey's got a boyfriend. Blair! Knock it off, Blair. Ugh. Well, sweetheart, you know I love you very much. Ever since the days I laid eyes on you. At the orphanage. Hey, you came from there too. Blair, can you give us some privacy? Ugh. Fine. Anyways, as I was saying, I love you very much. And I trust that you'll make the right decision with whatever happens, okay? Okay. Actually, uh, Aubrey, stay right there. I was going to give you this for Christmas or something, but I think you might like it a little early. Wow, Mom, thank you so much. It's beautiful. No problem, sweetheart. I saw it at a garage sale, and I just knew you'd love it. How does it look? Beautiful. <laughs> I love you, Mom. Thanks for adopting me. <laughs> You're welcome, sweetheart. I'd do it a thousand times over.